Did you ever date Raz B from B2K? Date is a loose word. Date is I wouldn't I wouldn't give that I wouldn't give that definition. I think I said entanglement. Who she thinks she is? Jada Pickett Smith? With but all of them except for Omari. Wait, what? She said all of them except for Omari? With but all of them except for Omari. <laughs> she had an entanglement with all of them except for Omari. Wow. Well, I've grown. I can it. Everybody has their no days. Let them have them. That's not true. Not everybody has their no days. We can look back on them days when we're older and be like, yeah, I was out there fighting. Fight, fight she said that like that's a good thing. But wait. Yeah, I know. You know what that term thought stands for, right? That hoe over there. Do you really want to be considered that hoe over there at any point of your life? It's not cute. It's not. I, I swear, if my wife ever looked at me and be like, yeah, I was a thought, I would be very upset with myself for marrying the wrong one. Keely, Sid, j Bug, Rasby, at the same damn time? Only one time. That's, that's only a one time thing. Here you have this married woman with kids coming out publicly saying something that honestly she should not have been saying on the internet for the world to see. If I were her husband, I would feel so disrespected, especially if she told the internet something that she had not previously told me. Regardless of the fact that whether she told him or not, for her to come out on the internet and say something like that, it's disrespectful to her husband. She's lucky that she's one of the few women on this earth that has been able to have this promiscuous lifestyle and still get chosen at the end of the day. But ladies, don't get it twisted for a second to think that you will still have that same type of luck if you go out here and have this youthful, promiscuous, thought and lifestyle and still expect to get held down when it comes time for you to want to get married. But before we get to the next clip, y'all, I'm happy to announce that this video is sponsored by none other than my favorite man, Space Care Brand, T. Henley. Now, y'all done heard me talk about them before, and I'm going to continue to talk about them because I know how much of a positive impact their products will have on your life. I'm serious. So I know some of y'all don't believe me when I tell you how much implementing a quality skincare routine will have on your self-confidence in all aspects of your life. Especially when you like me, fellas, and you're getting up in age a little bit. I just turned 35 years old, but can you tell? Can you tell? Nah, nah, you can't. Don't even lie. Don't even lie my name like that. But trust me, Teach Henley makes taking care of your skin uncomplicated. They provide you with all the things you need and nothing you don't. That's why I recommend you start with the level one system, which comes with all the basics. A daily face wash, an exfoliating scrub, an AM moisturizer with SPF 20, and a PM moisturizer. And to make it that much easier for guys like us, they provide this instruction card in every box that tells you what product to use, how much to use, and in what order. This card comes in clutch. Skincare wasn't something that I always took serious. I ain't even gonna lie to you. But now that I have, I wish I started a lot sooner, I'll tell you that. But don't take my word for it because they have over 5,000 five-star reviews from customers around the globe. And in addition to amazing skin, members of Teach Henley get tons of deals, including at least 20% off a of retail price, access to monthly deals, stop or pause your order anytime you like, and if you live in the US, free shipping. <laughs> no brainer. And because Teach Henley is sponsoring today's video, they're offering my viewers a great deal. Just click the first link down in the description box and get 30% off your first order and a free gift. Don't miss out on this amazing deal. Click that link and get started today. With that being said, back to your video. Quick story. I'm in Walmart. It's 7.30 a.m. I'm in the electronics section. I'm looking for a cord. I need some help. I asked the electronics guy. We're going back and forth. He goes to check me out. This is like three minutes into the interaction. Uh, I'm like, hey, you look really kind of like familiar to me. He says, that's because we Amy. Okay, how many sexual partners could you have possibly had as a female and not remember sleeping with somebody? 
unless it was one of those drunken one night stands that you absolutely regret it. But even then, like, how sloppy of a person could you be to not be coherent enough to know who it is that you're giving your body to? That's nothing to play with. That is some real clown behavior. Do you have anyone in the friend zone? Oh, I have a lot of people in the friend zone. Can you call one right now to Netflix and chill? If I call them, I'm going to go over there. Really? No, that's not the yeah. point. You know I'm going to run over there quick. Oh, so you want him? Yes, yeah, she does. I don't want him. I want that heat. <laughs> Yo, I like her. I like her. She is freaking hilarious. I want him. I want that heat. <laughs> Who do I call? Who? No, don't say that name. Oh, Nick. Oh my God, he's gonna be like my wife. Mm. Don't do it, fellas. Don't do it. Don't fall subject to this foolishness. You, you see these girls, you see how they laughing and carrying on? They know that those guys that are friends with them really wanna smash them. You see how she was like, oh, he's gonna be like my wife. Yeah, because they know. They're not oblivious to any of it. They know you wanna smash. I promise you, gonna be like, hello, hello. Yeah. Are you, were you sleeping? Yeah. Damn, I was gonna ask you if I, like, you wanted to come over and do, like, Netflix or chill or something. Oh, yeah? Yeah. A little late, baby, come over me. I know. We'll make it happen. We'll make oh. it happen. Okay. Why don't you come with energy like this more often? I don't know. Why don't you come with energy like this more often? What happens every single time these girls call one of their guy friends? The guy is always D T F every single time. You probably should. Okay, I will. All right, good night. What's the craziest thing you did this year? Oh, had a threesome, first ever, oh, and it went really bad. It didn't go bad, but I, it was with my best friend and her husband, uh -huh. and she got mad at me because he nutted in me and not her. <laughs> Sensational. <laughs> Well, yeah, okay, see, well, it was good for her, but see, that's where the couple messed up at, though. If they were going to partake in those type of activities, they shouldn't have done it with someone that was so close to them. It also sounded like they didn't set the right parameters around that whole ordeal, but at the end of the day, for that situation, who was in the wrong? The wife, not the friend, not the husband, the wife, because she should have iterated to that man that, hey, look, if you're gonna finish, you gotta finish with me. So she really has no room to get upset at the fact that he finished on her best friend or with her best friend. Tell me your biggest secret. I'm Tia, my boyfriend. There's like five other guys. I'm confused how he doesn't know. Because I she have has a separate account. account. Well, why not just break up with your boyfriend? Right. Because I love him. She is cheating on her boyfriend with five other men and not willing to break up with her boyfriend because she loves him. Now I wonder what it really is. Because from my understanding, and maybe I'm ignorant, because if a woman is cheating on her man, typically doesn't that mean that she doesn't love him? She looks like a really young girl, so I'm not expected for her to be expecting very much from the, whatever man that it is that she's dealing with. So what could it actually be? I wish I knew the truth, but we know that was a bold-faced lie. Anyway, y'all leave your thoughts, comments, and opinions down below, and I'm going to catch y'all in the next one. See you.